Hey guys. Christopher Hitchens was definitely one of the smartest people out there, and may even be regarded today as an original Meg Tao. Throughout his life, he trolled a lot of women and some miserable feminists with his old-school approach to relationships. In this clip, Hitchens triggers the interviewer when asked if he would let a girl he was living with work in a job. Enjoy the video. You, you mentioned your children before. You have um, a, an adult son. You know um, what it's like to be the child of a dull man, a dull father. What do you think it's like to be the child of Christopher Hitchens? Um, rather irritating. <laughs> I would think. Uh, well, embarrassing. Probably. Well, certainly with children when they're younger, even if they don't disapprove of what their parents do, they don't particularly want to be reading about it in any paper where their schoolmates could read about it. You just don't want attention drawn to yourself. You said you weren't much of a father when they were young. No. You better now? Much. I get better as people get older. But most men are pretty hopeless when <coughs> newborn bundles arrive. And they're, they're so... I'm incredibly impressed by how women appear to know what to do, and then they think, well, I'll go off and do extra work and make some money, and they justify it in that way. Christopher, I've heard you say this. Yeah, um, and well, now I'm seeing you're hearing me say it again. No, but my point would be that I think after the 70s that is actually not true. That may have been true, but I don't think that is true, that men are so less capable of dealing with children and that it's better that they go off, go off and earn money. You know, maybe the mother well, could go and earn some money. Did no, that never occur to you? I'm not having you? any woman of mine go to work. <laughs> you know you're going to no, get into trouble need, if you no, go they down don't there. Need, no, I won't, no, they don't need to work. They can, they can if they like, but they don't have to. You are joking, aren't no, you? No, I'm not. No, I would expect, oh, to, tell take, me I would expect to take care of them. They work if you want, but you don't have to. You are the commander's son, aren't yeah, you? Yes. I am, yes. You, you really mean that? Sure. You don't think women should go and work? Yeah, I said they're welcome to do that. I'm thrilled if they want to. But if they don't want to, they don't have to. Is this that's you being I'm, ironic? Is this your for. famous attachment to irony? No. What's so, what's so difficult about it? It's just wrong. <laughs> <laughs> it's just absolutely wrong. No, they're called the gentle sex for a good reason. You want to see them? You want to see them coarsened in the in the <laughs> coarsened in the labour market? No. Not if, not if they don't want to. They You're shouldn't 61, feel they, they shouldn't feel they not have 180. to. No, I'm, that's not good. I'm here to. I've given you every single chance to opt out of that last. Oh statement. no, no. I mean, I, 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 that's my view. I don't think a, a Mrs. Hitchin should have to work. It's been lovely to have you. Thank you so much. Oh, it's very nice of you to invite me. Please, a huge thank you to the sexist but charming Christopher <laughs> Hitchin. Thank you very much.